Oh. Yay! Oh, look. It's confidential. Why does it seem like we always find these? Guess where we finally are, guys? We are here at a storage unit we just bought, because guess what? We found a live auction and we got a unit. $110, kind of bid on it for a stupid reason. Fingers crossed my stupid reason pays out. Let's do it. Oh, it looks about a five by five, five by seven with a decent amount of boxes to the back for $110 right now. That is a steal. This would have went for $550 on Storage Treasure. So let's go through it and see what we have. First, get this thingy out the way. What is that anyway? Uh, a roof to something? Looks like a roof, like, yeah, like a little thing for toddlers or something. Yeah. Let me show you the stupid reason we bid on this unit. First, get this junk out the way like this. Party stuff. So you guys know I'm a Dragon Ball Z fanatic. That, uh, it was laying like this. If you know, this looks like the back of King Kai's head, one of the Dragon Ball Z characters, but it is it's a freaking <laughs> vampire. <clears throat> I thought I had it. I thought I, it looked just like it. All right, so we got this guy. Ooh, it's pretty cool, right? It's pretty hot. Yeah. Mm, looking good. <laughs> Skeleton. Let's get these out the way. That is legitimately the only <laughs> reason I've been on the <laughs> It didn't work. And it didn't have a lot of furniture in it, which is a plus. Yeah, that's good. So. Christmas decorations, Halloween, <laughs> holiday stuff, you know, stuff like that. Throw it out the yard, say I'll get a dollar or two for the bag. What's in here though? Amazon? What's it actually say? Pin the uh, P on the guy. A bachelorette stuff. All right. So there it goes again. All I gotta do is walk sensor. backwards. <laughs> so stupid, I hate motion sensored lights. So yeah, this looks like exactly what it is. Party stuff, but it looks nice. like it might be new. So yeah. we might be able to sell this stuff as like a lot to somebody. What else can I get into? Yeah. All right. Pooh. Pooh bear, Winnie the Pooh with his honey pot. And this is a big stuffed animal, like a Valentine's Day bear, but there's stuff underneath of him. So let's see what that stuff is. <clears throat> Looks like a, it's a keyboard. A keyboard and some other computer wires and a mouse and things like that. So computer stuff. What is in this thing? Let's see, what do we have in here? That's a flip-flop. I thought that was a toy. Whoa. Mirrors? What? What is that? I don't know. I don't know. Uh, shoes. Randomness. Well, what's in here? This is just school supplies in there, unfortunately. And well, well look at that. Nice. Nightmare Before Christmas snow globe. Ooh. That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. Back when they bought it whenever it was 20 bucks, but who knows how old it is. Mary Kay, it was, it's zipped. And it has nothing in it. So, besides the snow globe, not much in that box. Let's roll this nice shelf out too, by the way. Get on out By here. the way, this hallway has carpet. This is a nice facility in general. <laughs> Motion is. sensor lights are usually like everyone likes them, but for us recording, they're kind of annoying. Yes. So, another skeleton. All right. Hello, skeleton Throw him down. That's my favorite part. Ooh, feels heavy. that's got weight to it, <laughs> <laughs> but it actually does. But I'm pretty sure it's just gonna be a book because <laughs> they always are. A key and get, get out and a book and charger pieces and stuff like that. Samsung S7 box with no phone, unfortunately. Just get it, get out of here. What's in the basket? More Nightmare Before Christmas. Patrick. And Patrick. What is Patrick? He's like a, I don't even know, he looks <laughs> weird. Yeah. And then a little Nightmare Before Christmas guy, isn't it? Yeah, Jack Skellington. Yeah, I've never seen the movie. There's some keys in here, so I'm gonna put these in my pocket just in case. <laughs> these are mini U keys. That's the storage <laughs> facility. What? All right, that's kind of Couldn't odd. Couldn't see it, but guys, it said mini U. Yeah, what's <laughs> in here? Pencils? No, actually some stuff. Let's see what these cards are. Oh, that's their driver's license. I'll put that in my pocket. And this is AutoZone Rewards. AMC rewards and crown, they're all reward club, reward cards. So nothing like that. Let's see, do I know this person? No, I don't. This is the area I grew up in around here. So like when I find stuff, I gotta look at it and see if I recognize them. One day it's gonna happen. One day. Uh, that's just school supplies. Let's see what's in the boxes. 
Well, that was a hair press for 60 bucks, but I can already tell you. It's empty. It's empty. Stupid lights. I don't <laughs> like you. That's empty. I just got a little, do a little two step backwards. This one's empty, but this one's heavy. All right. What's in the love box? Is this something I'm gonna love? Mm. Mm, cards with no money. I don't love that. Yeah, I don't. What's this? Nothing. What are these? Like memories, basically? Some yeah. Bridal stuff. Wedding stuff. Yeah, that's exactly what I'm getting to. But at least they knew that the king was buying this unit. <laughs> I am the king. Da, 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 da. It's a little small for my head, huh? Yeah, a little bit. What's in here? Amazing oh, grace. Oh, what are these? Whoa. Hair curlers. Hair curlers. These are metal duckbill clips. Okay. I'm guessing all the stuff's probably for hair. Yes. Hair stuff. I was wondering what these were. They look like a bunch of minions, don't they? <laughs> they are a bunch of minions. So, ah, okay, my crown's gone. I'm no longer the king. I relinquished my throne. Why do you have so many? Oh, they're squishies. They're squishies. Ah! Look at this, though. Nice. I mean, they have to be 20, 30, maybe even 40 of these in here. I don't know what these go for, but they do have a barcode, so it'll be really easy to scan and see cool. if they're worth anything. But and those are super that's cool. Yeah, super cool. That's cool. That's weird, though. Why did you buy 30 of the same thing? Maybe, Maybe for the wedding. Store. That or that. Play-Doh in Valentine's cards. And this is, yeah, I don't want to touch that box. What is this box, though? Fragile giftables. Giftables. Mothers only. All right, let's see. <laughs> I feel kind of offended. Stop going out. <laughs> I feel kind of offended that I can't have this gift because I'm not a mother. Oh look, is this like new stuff again? Um, well, let me put it down. Let's get one of these out and see what it is. Walgreens. That's exactly what it is. Look, it's like brand new gifts in here. <laughs> yeah, like little mug and stuffed bear combo. Unicorn. Unicorn. And. Are these brand new frames too? Mm, looks like it. Uh, let's see. These are actually, yeah look. Out of all the mothers in the world, I'm so glad you're mine. <laughs> so these are all brand new gifts. I'm liking the brand new stuff. You know, brand new stuff is a lot easier to sell. So it looks like three or four frames and three or four mugs in that box. So that's cool. Before we go any further guys, make sure you take two seconds for us and leave this video a thumbs up. It's been a long time since we bought a storage unit. We drove two hours to go to this auction to bring you a video. Leave us a thumbs up and of course subscribe if you do. Let's keep going and see what else we got. And this looks like it could very well be something else brand new. They are what? all brand new. They're like, this had to be stuff that was used for a wedding that ended up getting canceled or something. Or, or just a party. Yeah, but I mean, I'm guessing off the bridal stuff, you know what I mean? Yeah. I just wouldn't think that anybody had minions. <laughs> Do you still have a tag in here? They paid, I'm getting so tired of this light. They paid six bucks a piece. This total on this receipt, $322 for these. Whoa. I think I did, they're from Rite Aid. I think I gotta just go back to Rite Aid and be like, yo, I don't really want them no more. Just Maybe. Give me this money, just Maybe. bring it all back. That would be pretty cool. Yeah, it would. I don't know if that's illegal because technically it is new and I'm not like yeah. taking it from when they paid for it. Let's see what's in here. New York cheer. More new stuff, hopefully. <clears throat> yes, it is. Look it's at this. New year, so. This is, is it marked with the year though? Or is it just happy new year? It looks like just happy new year. Happy. Yeah, just new year. See, it's good. It's good. If it said good. new year 2020 on it, then we'd be in trouble. Look on the back. It shows you what's all in there. Oh, cool. Look at that. Look, five lays, five hats, tears, horns, party blowers. Cool, and I see more Nightmare Before Christmas in here. Look at this guy. Hey. He's like one of the ones, I don't want to press his button, but I can tell based on feeling him. He's one of those ones that dance and sing and stuff like that. Don't so. press his buttons, he might get mad. He might get mad. There's also a couple of the same things, but they're like Christmas bears that dance and stuff like that. And then there's a gravestone and a Santa stuff here side. <laughs> <laughs> All right, what else is on this shelf? Um, we got this box of shoes. Basically just all shoes and no, oh, I see Yoshi, it looks like. Yeah, look at that. Yoshi. A few little kids toys, nothing expensive, like just cheaper end stuff, but we'll just throw it at a yard sale, maybe just donate, depending on how we do on the rest of the stuff. But yeah, some random kids toys. What kind of jacket is this? Make sure we don't have nothing high end. Fresh New York. All right, oh, it yeah. looks fresh. I'll give it to him. And yeah, that's all for this shelf, by the way. Nice shelf, huh? Actually, we didn't go up here, did we? No. I'm tired of the light. All right. A couple baskets with some random stuff in it. This, by the that way. Pink one, too. Yeah. 
two Dell computer monitors. These are pretty hard to sell nowadays. I, mean, I usually get like five bucks or something, but probably just throw it at our yard sale to be honest with you. But look at this. This is like brand spanking new too, it looks Dang. like. Crafting. Brand new. What is this one? B. Okay, that one's been used, but. Kids jewelry making. All right. Overall though, I think this shelf easily paid for what we paid for the unit. Let's go down here. Somebody lost a foot. They lost <laughs> their footing there. That was but, skeleton number ones. All right, let's see what's in <laughs> this skeleton. You already named them thing one yeah, and thing two. Thing one, thing two. Okay, we're not showing that. That's, That's a. Fly. That is a big dead horse fly. Jeez. He's a big boy, but he's dead. So, what's in? Oh, look. Hmm. It's confidential, oh. but it's empty. I think. Let's make sure. No, it's not empty. It's got like one piece of paper in it. Let's see what's in it. I'm curious. Not confidential no more. <laughs> uh. Oh, it's just like school meeting for a mom, like something they sent home with your kid from school. Boring. So yeah, when I say confidential, I think confidential. Let's see what's over here. What is this, a painting? A dolphin Ooh. with a slash in it. Somebody didn't like it. Nope. Put that guy over here. Let's just go to, what is this that doesn't fall down? So it looks like the bottom of one of those like plastic drawer things. Mm -hmm. That's what I'm guessing. I like your shirt, by the way. Oh, I know, it's beautiful, right? Ooh, Ooh. check that out, baby Jesus design. looks clean. It looks clean. Oh, this is really heavy. Whoa. Oh. Yeah, All right. Yeah. Let's see what's in this one. Somebody's blowing up my phone over there. Um, it's like sideways. Oh, no. Yeah. What does it say? School notebooks. Yeah, and that's exactly what it is. All school notebooks. So that is staying in its box. Let's pull down this little white box. And it's got more, more new stuff. What is that? Uh, Starbucks. Have a... Well, Azure's Frappy B Day Brunch. All right, people are obsessed with Starbucks. I bet you there's somebody out there that collects Starbucks. These are picture frames, some letters, a P. Hey, look, there's an A you can have. Hey. And I don't know what this is, but there's apron. signs down here. It's an apron. It's a Starbucks apron. Look. Pretty Boom. sure all these things were used to decorate, like, for promotional stuff at Starbucks. So, probably they must have worked there. Oh. What are these? Oh, oh my goodness. Pop it! If you didn't have fun tormenting your parents and family, oh, they are. If you didn't torment your parents and family <laughs> with these as a kid, you didn't have a childhood. I used to get these off the ice cream truck for 50 cents. Then, you know, you tell your mom, we need to go to the store. As soon as they come out, boom! <laughs> all Good the memories. whole box. The whole box. Yeah. All at once. And it's all worth it for that. Whoa! <laughs> worth it. <laughs> worth it. Let's see what this. This is Alan's box. All right, Alan, what you got? I see Dove soap. That's good. We'll keep it. Ooh, look. Hey, this is Psalm. Hey, it's 20, 2020. What are the signs? Man cave, Man enter cave. at your own risk. <laughs> Stupid light. It's funny to have like these two right next to each other. I know. Man cave, enter at your own risk. Love. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, are these just frames? These are mirrors, mirrors, actually. I'm sweaty in here. Hi, how you doing over there? Hi. Look at that cool camera setup. Look Woo. at that hoodie, too. It's a little <laughs> washed, but you know, it's been a while. And some vases, or one vase in there. Let's just leave that one right there. Let's pull out this bag, because it has some interesting looking boxes in it. Let's see, what's specially for me? It better be specially for me, actually. Oh, what's some pink cups? This looks like a little, this looks like some beer pong cups, and yeah, look, drinking game. So, that's what that is. Boring. Especially for you. So I don't even drink, I hate alcohol. <laughs> But I guess it's for me. Frozen. What is that? Orange blossom scented soaps. Ooh, three soap. We'll probably keep those. Fancy. When's the last time we had to buy soap? I have no idea. Like, it's been over a year. Probably when we first moved here. <laughs> All right, nothing else in that. And that's everything here. Let's get the crooked box. So it's really light, actually. But there's, it's not empty, but it's really light. Labeled it. Good. Yes. Thank you. Yes. All right. Good. <laughs> Jack and Sally. I was about to say, they must have really liked... <sighs> it's just getting old. They must have really liked <laughs> Nightmare Before Christmas, huh? Yep. Two little pillows here. Let's put these right there. Turning can't on break the lights them. just a two-step away. Yeah. Ooh, we'll see Let what's in this see one. Let you one two-step. No, don't get me copyrighted. <laughs> what's in this one? Uh, more party stuff. Somebody was uh, Nightmare Before... Whoa. Nightmare hey. Before Christmas obsessed hey. party designer. So yeah, look at that. Six things of magic erasers and all this stuff's brand new. Tickets, 
more markers, gift cards, not gift cards, like invitations, decorations, just a whole lot of party stuff that again, all brand new. So whatever they were planning apparently never happened. Unless it's their job, maybe, I don't know. Let's get out the long skinny box. It looks like, well, all right. That was just that blue thing. Ooh, it's Ninja Turtles, whatever it is, but mm -hmm. we'll get to that. Ooh, is this a camera? Please be a camera. Please be a good camera too. Oh, it's a, it's an old camera. Actually, it's one of those Polar, those newer ones, isn't it? The, the newer Polar, you don't think they like remake the Polaroids? Yeah, they do. I don't know. Let's so actually, look, it has this Polaroid product registration, one 600 classic. If it says classic, it's not classic. Because <laughs> it's been yeah. redesigned. So I don't know what those go for right now. What's this? What, there's, I've never seen so much new stuff in one unit. It's kind of weird. That little fairy. There goes our light. I had to walk back further that time. It's getting mean. Some little bags. There's a lot of bags in here. Look at this. Here's another one. Oh, thanks, thanks. It, is, it is, isn't it? Ugh. Little leopard one. This one looks like leathery. Let's see if it has a brand on it. Love something. Love Betsy by Betsy Johnson. Oh, Love Betsy. Love Betsy. Is it Betsy? It's <laughs> like a British accent almost. <laughs> All right. Betsy. Look at this one. It's got a little dude on it, little thing on it. Ah, oh, there's a head in here. Ah! <sighs> I found a human head in a box. <laughs> <laughs> looks like a Bratz doll. Yeah, it looks like one of the things that do makeup. Oh my God, there's something so nostalgic in here. Look, oh, actually, this one wait. feels like it has something in it. I don't know if it's gonna be nostalgic for you, but it's nostalgic oh. for me. Well, but you got me excited, and they tore me down. You know how many hey, of these I had as a kid at the, when you have your birthday party? At the bowling alley, they give you one pin for everybody there to sign. That's so nostalgic right there. I had a lot of parties at birthday. That's at nostalgic for me because I went to your parties. <laughs> and I remember seeing them. This looks like pictures and stuff. Set that over here. Ooh, Yay! An actual found, piggy I've never found an actual piggy bank. Let's see if it's all just <laughs> pennies or... It's actually, ooh, that's not coming. That's glued. Look, is it? they glued it. It's super glued down. That's, well, I see silver though, so it's not all pennies. Yay. That's good. We'll have to actually bust the penny bake open. Multiplication or addition cards. Ready? I'm gonna quiz you. Oh, no. <laughs> Put me on the spot. I will not know what three plus two is. Yep, it's like I know. I get them all right, right when you point the camera. Okay, three plus two, seven. Uh. Bathroom stuff. Or no, it's more like, what's two plus two? Uh, uh, and then yeah. come up with the answer. There's another head down there. There's another brat's head. And then there's this, which is like soaps and stuff like that. What is this actually? That's part of a vacuum, mm. no sharper image. I think, mm. you know what it looks like? You put it on your shoe and you turn your shoe into a roller skate. Maybe, but other than that, there's just another brat's doll head. Let's see what's in this box. This one's also very light. But it's Nightmare Before hey. Christmas themed too. I see like the little Christmas balls on it. It was just a Christmas wreath. Any other time of the year besides December, that's basically garbage. <laughs> but December, you'll sell it. Why yeah. don't people stock up? I don't know. Why, why not buy it now just to they have it? They throw it away every year because they don't want it in their house. And then Christmas comes back around and like, we need it, right? <laughs> this says Christmas too, so. Yep, sure is. A lot of Christmas, Christmas light. Hey, look, there's some white ones right hey, there. Hey, there you go, Mom. Yep. Found a box. White Christmas, there's two oh, of them. Found another one. Two. And they're pretty big boxes, too. They look 62.7 feet. 300 lights. Yeah, I mean, there's 62 feet, though, so that's 120 feet of white lights right Alrighty. there. Alrighty. We needed those, so that works. Let's set that right here. What else? <clears throat> I can sit on this, right? It would support yep. me. Little tykes, I think it will. I'm a little tyke. <laughs> I mean, maybe my leg is, but the rest of me, not so much. Can we put this up? What? I don't know. <laughs> Panda mask. That looks like the dinosaur one we got. Like, it's made the same way. How many people in the comment? How many people in the comments when I say, Oh my God, you put that on, you're gonna die, or some crazy <laughs> stuff. Yeah, maybe. <laughs> Let's just put this up here. Good enough. It's annoying. Let's get this big box here. Ooh. Put it right here. Bounce. Ah! Stupid lights. All right. Look, more Nightmare Before Christmas. Look, this little guy, these are both from there, I'm assuming? Yeah. All right, what's this big thing though? Is that also from there? What is that? That's his dog. 
Oh, well, cool. <laughs> oh, there's a big boy. Look. Oh, cool. He's huge, though. He, like, hangs on the door or something. Yeah. What's up, Jack Skellington? That's a big boy. His <laughs> hands bend and stuff, so I can move him around. Oh, there's a girl, too. Look. Hey. Cool. And, yeah, there's a lot of them in there. So, I mean, people love this show. So, or the movie. It's a movie or show. Sorry, I don't know. I, I know it's a it. movie. I don't know if they made it to a show because it's so popular or not. But. but, yeah, there's a lot of stuff from that show in here. A movie. This bag, I can see in there. It's brand new, but there's a lot of just Christmas balls in there. Like, just the regular, like, generic mm. ones you get from Walmart or somewhere. Like those? Yeah, exactly like those. Let's see what's in here. This one looks interesting. I see, like, fancy looking stuff. Oh, it's just bags. But. They're new. Yeah, they're new. Everything's new in here. In here, looks like we got a lot of new makeup. Wet and Wild, some more makeup palettes. Um, this is, I'm gonna see, I can tell if I feel like it's more makeup sticks. This looks like some kind of punch. What's that? I see a coin down here. Microtech. Never heard of it. Huh, that's cool, I guess. Other than that, it's just mugs and stuff like that. But again, like, it seems like. 80% of this stuff is brand new, which is still weird. This bag, it looks like it has all toys in it. So I don't see much in there besides like stuffed animals in that one car, but the car doesn't have like a battery or anything or a controller with it. So it's probably nothing right now. Let's pull this guy out and see what's in here. Oh, this one's heavy again. Is it going to fit on this? Yeah, as long yeah. as you balance, right? <laughs> I'll try. This is a Michael Kors jacket. So this should probably be on Poshmark, most definitely. And then we have another jacket, which is, oh, it's got some leather patches and stuff. I don't know what brand it is though. There it is. It's a, what does that even say? Fresh New York right. again? Weird. All right. Um, overall, it looks like kitchen stuff. things in like the plastic? This? Yeah. Nightmare Before Christmas glasses. Hey. They have Nightmare Before Christmas everything. There's another one too. Just Nightmare Before Christmas, Nightmare Before Christmas. Soon they're gonna have, I don't even know what else they can have Nightmare Before Christmas, but that. This bag is just like the other one. Tons of brand new Christmas balls. But again, brand new, brand new, brand new. Let's pull out, I guess this. Yeah. There's like a few things in there. It looks like a coin. Let's see. Ooh, a phone and 50 cents. Yay. A phone and 50 cents. 51 cents. <laughs> Area 51, right? So look. Ah, come here. Come here. 51 cents. Ooh. And a phone. And that drawer. This drawer. An anchor. Some tissues. This one. Envelopes and some keys. All right. Oh, with anything in these envelopes, another brand new. So we can definitely use those shipping wise. And I'll put the phone in my pocket because these tell a story. The little box here. This is like another thing that trolled me. Looks hmm. again. Look it's at the that. same thing. That's King Kai right there. <laughs> the ears, the hat, the color, the skin, everything. You turn it around, it's not. A dinosaur, an Elmo, and a lunchbox. Just put that one right there. Uh, is this more Christmas? Oh no, this is way too heavy. This might be clothes. I think. Um, towels. Mm. Lots of towels. Boring. Set that over here. What is this? Ugh. This has got some weight to it. Oh, this, well, why you open it? This. This. <laughs> uh, they taped this one apart. It says, this is frames. Be careful. So these might be personal pictures. Let's Can see. Cheer stuff? What? Cheer stuff? It says frames too. So I don't know. I don't see any frames really. Hmm. There's, I mean, a ward, some more kid stuff. Um, that, this, hashtag squad. What? Shoes, a Funko. A little somebody Funko. There's another A for you. Oh, look. Crap. <laughs> Crap of the face. I was like, oh. Yay! Okay, nothing in there. Next bag here. Let's see if this one just closed or what it is. Now, this looks like baby stuff. Why does it seem like we always find these? Mm -hmm. These cremated remains. Why is that in the baby bag? I don't know. That's kind of... And it's so small. 
I know. Oh man. Don't say what I want you to. What I'm thinking either. Let's just not say it. Um. Let's see what's in the desk. See if it is what we think it is. The funeral home. I don't see any like date to date on it though. So this is not helping. Um. It doesn't say how old whoever it was that passed away, but of course, I'm just, look, man. This is exactly what this is. Yeah. Oh no, 1920, 1990 to 2010. That's rough, 20 years old, but it's a different name. Hmm. But yeah, well, of course, this whole bag will go right back to them. I'll just put it over here at the other personal stuff. Get that, um, put that white thing with it. Yeah, I will. That's just, yeah, that's sad. It's crazy. Younger than me. Seven years younger than me, man. You never know. Nope. But that was 11 years ago. But still, definitely get that back to him. Let's see what's <clears> in <throat> here. Uh, kitchen stuff. Paperwork. Shapes. Pentagon. Hey, look. Some aluminum foil. We'll keep yeah. this. <laughs> it's like we get excited over the dumbest stuff in storage units because it's like, I don't have to buy it. And bags. We have some other kitchen stuff that we might use. There's more aluminum foil. There's like a good six or seven things of aluminum foil in here. Okay. So that will definitely be used. Let's get this little box up in the corner here and see what's in here. Is this personal? I mean, I would. Mm, I'd assume it's personal. I'll yeah. put it with personal. These are all Christmas ornaments. These are. I don't even know what that says. Love. Oh, love, but it's out of order. Christmas. Oh. <laughs> Oh, all right. Christmas theme glove. Yeah. These are all Christmas ornaments, so I'll add that to the personal pile. We'll get this out the way here. And let's go to the next one. We're starting to get to the end now here. This is a good lot of stuff for 110 bucks. I'm happy. Yeah. Oh, jeez. Heavy? Yeah, what is in here? Books? Laptop charger. That's a good thing. And there goes that again. The light. <laughs> There's a crap ton of hair in here. Brand new. Look. I mean, a lot, lot. Uh, checkbook with nothing in it. Some more personal. No, it's unused. BB and T. Um, notebooks and a lot of other stuff. It looks. This looks like their personal paperwork, most likely. So I'm just gonna put this aside. Let's see what's in the purple tote now. Whoa! What you got? Mm. More paperwork, huh? Yeah. Oh well, looks like we're getting into the paperwork section of this. Some shoes though. Shoes. Baby clothes and shoes. It's more like kid artwork, not even like bills or anything. Yeah, no. Hey look. Shell. We just sold all our other ones and now we get a new bag full of them. Yeah, this is again. I mean there's some cards and stuff down here that will try to return. Just make sure though. You always gotta make sure there's no money on it. You can't return money. This is the business <laughs> at the end of the day. So, but all the personal stuff. They always get back like these. Let me open like one or two more just to be sure. Yeah, there's nothing. And let's check this one right here. There's nothing. I'm assuming they're all nothing. Yeah. So these are probably all just nothing. Send those back with the other personal stuff. Other than that, I don't think there's much in here. Oh, let's see what's in the trash can here. That's nothing. Bits and pieces, but nothing. Actually, what is it? Nope, nothing. Just paper. These are like what you send gift cards in, but they're not in here. So is this. But again, nothing in there. So this is probably all like people stock up, you know, after Christmas it goes on sale super cheap. Stock up, you're smart. I'm you pretty know. sure this is like what you put rolling. Oh, it's not a trash paper. can? Yeah, these are all brand new. Is that what's in there? All Christmas decorations. Yep, no thank you. We're not gonna go through that. Got a six foot five Christmas tree. My sash tree, literally. That is that exact height just about. Five. This looks like a bird cage. Yes. Next to a reptile tank too. <coughs> Let's put that there. Oh, this is actually hamster. It looks like it looks like they have stuff in there for hamsters. Yeah. We just used them for reptiles, so that's what I think it has in the reptile tank. Is I that see a them. mermaid tail? It is a mermaid tail. You gotta put that on. Oh, it's oh a the shark. shark! It's a costume. That's pretty cool. Let's see. This is empty. That's part of a Ninja Turtle bed. Mm -hmm. This is Halloween. Whoa. 
a lot of Halloween. Stuff in there. A lot of brand new stuff though. By the way, if you want to see what's in more detail, you guys should subscribe to our second channel. That link's down in the description. We do the videos where we go through everything in more detail because we move kind of fast here. We know it. So for those of you that want it to be slower and look through it, make sure you go there because there's a lot of videos on there already. Let's see what's in this big boy. It's another Christmas tree. Another one. A white Christmas tree this time. Here is some pink doo-doo. Mm -hmm. Unicorn poop. <laughs> Um, what's in here? Is this more paperwork? This is more paperwork. Uh, a reindeer, a dog? That's a dog. That's a dog. <laughs> Sorry, all the Christmas stuff is persuading my mind. <laughs> this is, hey look, memory. Brand new memory, by the way, like everything else. Still sealed. And a unicorn and a little bag. I'm just, it's so weird that everything I pulled off pretty much is sealed. All brand new stuff. What, what's going on here? Oh, there's two boxes stuck together. Look at that. Robin. Just a bunch of kids' toys. Here's a old Chevy truck. It's metal on the top. That's kind of cool. Thought I got lucky. Thought this would be the laptop, but it's just the laptop case. There's nothing in there, unfortunately. So, this right oh. here looks like lots of paperwork. Woof. Yeah. That's all them. You can have that. <laughs> So it's, that looks like the same thing, doesn't it? Kids books, I mean. Some mirrors, <laughs> I mean, this is more like, yeah, just kids stuff, so. That's not really personal stuff. This, textbooks, schoolwork. I'm just gonna leave that. Book bag here. Hey, there it is. Look, oh, that's a Toshiba. What else is in there? I don't even know what that is, a DVD player? No idea. Let's see if this thing lists the specs anywhere. Hopefully it does. It's got Windows 10, yeah. that's a good sign, so at least it's probably newer. But yeah, we'll plug it in when we get home and see what kind of specs it has on it. Nothing else in here. Oh, look, is this another one? The it's charger the we found said Dell on it. I know. I wonder if it's a replacement or what. Is this just CDs? Yep. R. Kelly. Oh look, there's some hey, actual ones. Real Nelly. ones. Nelly. Ying Yang Twin. There's some good stuff. Lil' right. Kim. Uh, is that 50? No, it's Outcast. Outcast. It looks like one of his CDs too though. Yeah, there's some good stuff in here. I'll take that. Let's see what's down here though. <laughs> Ooh. No, I thought to say it might be closed, but it doesn't feel like it. A head. Another head. Third head in this unit. And curlers. Yeah, just hair stuff. Some fake hair, some curlers, some other things like that. That's all that's in this bag. What's down here? These are the personal pictures. This is at least. Oh my goodness. Oh my god! Well, we're added to our collection of 8 billion already. We can't technically ship it because it's flammable, so. I don't know what we're going to do with it all. Sell it on a marketplace. Yeah, maybe. we will. So I just moved that box of school stuff underneath of it. The other box is more school stuff. So I'm not going to go through that. But what I do see that's interesting here is Dr. Suits because, you know, they're trying to get rid of them now. Classic. So, yeah, I wonder if it's the classic or a reprint. Uh, Renew 1988. So it's not new, but it's not the original. So... I don't know what these go for now because obviously all the controversy and stuff. There's a few in there. I see Cat in the Hat and I think I see at least two other ones. So that could be money. But other than that, that's everything in the unit. So let's get it loaded in the truck and get it home. So now we're home and this one got crazy fast. Before I tell you the story that happened or unfolded, first let me give you a little bit of good news. So the laptop we found, it had an i5 processor, 500 gig hard drive. So it's not nothing special, but it's a good $80, $100 laptop. It's decent. There wasn't anything spectacular, but it's a decent little money maker. But that is not the crazy thing. So the crazy thing happened is when I got home and started doing my research on the owner. So while we were going through it, you may have noticed there was a random awkward cut in the middle of the video. That's because the manager came to us and said that the former owner called and asked to make sure, you know, make sure, not please, make sure they get their personal stuff back. We always do this anyway, or we always give them their pictures, stuff like the cremated remains, stuff their kids did, anything that is valuable to them emotionally, 
we give it back anyway, right? That's just what we do, that's the right thing to do, so why wouldn't you do it? So we did that, right? But with the first thing I usually do when I get home is I attach my camera to the computer, I let the video files transfer, and while they're transferring to my computer, I like to look into the owner. The first thing I do, a search on is their Facebook profile. It's usually really easy to find their Facebook profile. And the first thing I see on their Facebook profile from yesterday is a post saying that their unit is going up for auction to their fam, you know. So I was like, okay. And then today, the day of the auction, they had another post on Facebook and said, someone bought our unit, help us out. Obviously, I'm not putting myself in a danger zone. I'm not putting my name out there because I don't want nobody to know who I am. We're already on YouTube, which is bad enough, but I'm not direct messaging these people or agreeing to meet them in person. You can't hurt me through the computer. I don't know what somebody can do in real life. Somebody could do some bad things. So, in response, I went down to the comments, responded to that post, and there was somebody that says, I was there, fam, I got you. So somebody apparently was at the auction, but if they were really trying to buy it back and they knew it had somebody's cremated remains in it, first of all, why didn't you say anything? Second of all, why did you only bid $100? It's weird, it's just, it doesn't add up. But the thing that's bothering me is the fact that somebody might have been there, seen us being the ones bid on it, and I don't know what could have, you know, I didn't know, like somebody could have been following us, somebody could have looked at our tags, somebody could have looked where we went home at, there's so many things that could have happened, and I didn't suspect anything because I didn't read this post until I had already gotten this stuff home. So I don't know what to do. It's definitely threatening. That's a little threatening, but indirectly threatening. I just think filing a police report is kind of stupid because what is that gonna do? Whatever, but I don't know. It's just weird. What do you guys think we should do about this? Let me know what you think down in the comments. Don't forget to check out the second channel. Subscribe if you're new. Leave the video a thumbs up, guys. Peace out.